never knew a la 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 a la like this. Hello, Fusion fans. Gina and I'm here with the coordinators of Barcada Modern. So <laughs> we have over here Lee, Dominic, Kim, and Bob slash Bobbert slash Robert. He said you can choose whatever you want. Yeah. <laughs> Yay! So let's start this, guys. So let's start off with a question of who is Barcada Modern? Well, Barcada Modern is a team based out of Cal Poly Pomona. Hey, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you can put all the pretty parts in, don't worry. Alright, uh, we're a team organized from the club Barcada, which is a Filipino based club at Cal Poly Pomona. Uh, it was founded three or four years ago? In 2005. 2005. <laughs> yeah, one of our founding members. Do you want to elaborate? <laughs> okay. Elaborate? Um, basically, Barcada Modern started from like you said, the Filipino club Barcada. Um, it was basically just people who wanted to dance, and so it stemmed from APN and it evolved into a dance team, and it became a competitive team in 2007, and we've been competing ever since. Mm -hmm. So you guys are still baby competing teams. How does it feel? Only, I think, four years in, right? Did I do my math right? Yeah, their first competition was in 2007. Maxed out. So it's been a while. We had to work our way up. So it's definitely it's a fun experience to come as the underdogs, and then we really that really pushes us to exceed our own expectations and to really have fun dancing mm -hmm. together. Mm -hmm. So um, being so well, not really fresh out, but being only like four years in, where do you guys see yourself now, up until in the future? Well, I definitely have a lot of hope in the future for this team. Um, <clears throat> it's really starting to, well, first getting a studio, that was a big step for us. So that's um, definitely a step in the right direction. And I really feel this team is growing um, not, uh, as a team and really learning to work together and dance on stage together. So that's something we're definitely learning as a slow process. And it's really been a fun experience to be here in all the hours and hell weeks and Sweating and all that good stuff, so it's good times. Oh, yes. Well, I know the answer. <laughs> exactly. Everybody, when you ask them what makes you so unique, is their answer is it's because we're a family. Now I'm gonna ask you the same question: What makes you guys so unique? But don't say it because we're family. So we use something else. Trick question. <laughs> <laughs> Um, we're really uh, a team that has a lot of different backgrounds. Um, we're not really, we, recently we're really a team that's, um, like a lot of us have like contemporary backgrounds, some of us are um, tap dancers, we have ballet dancers, so we're not just a hip hop team. So I think this year our team has really evolved, not just to hip hop, but we're really trying to um, demonstrate the different talents that you, you don't just have to dance and compete hip hop. To, um, to inspire, you can really uh, open boundaries and really expose all different types of dancing. So I think that definitely sets us apart and it's definitely um, one, in, one of our hidden talents. <laughs> and I think also the fact that, um, yeah, we come from different dance backgrounds, but we also come from different, I guess, personal backgrounds also, and we all have different personalities. We all have like our inner weirdness. Um, inside but somehow it all just works and I think that's what makes us unique is that we don't try to force things we are here to dance but our bond is it just happens and um, I don't know be not something that you can't really explain but I think that's what I think is so special about it because it's that's what's unique to me about it why is it so hard to be a dancer I think it's just hard because you just have to balance everything in your life it's hard being a dancer because you know that there's so many other priorities that you have to take care of before dance. It's hard to be a dancer because you always feel like everything's against you. No one really promotes dancing. They think of it as a hobby instead of part of your life. It's hard growing up and feeling as if you only have to uh, join the workforce and do school. You can't really find this as a job. Um. 
it's hard being a dancer because you just don't want to grow up. But it's what you love, so that's why you keep coming back to it. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> thank you. All right, thank you. Thank you so much for that. So are you guys excited for Fusion? Yeah. Cool. We're really excited. Yeah. <laughs> Well, this is my second team on the year, and this will be my first time competing at Fusion, so um, I'm really excited. I, I've heard great things from Bobber because he's experienced Fusion two years ago, and he said it was one of it was his favorite competition of the year, yeah. and he's experienced all of them, like Vibe and all uh, Bridge and stuff, and he just felt it has a different vibe to it, so I'm excited to experience that, and we heard you guys are like, really welcome us and take care, care of us, we're excited to experience that, and... We are the crowds. Awesome. <laughs> so. um, I'm excited to see where we can go with this, um, where we can take this team with this competition because I know it's a really big opportunity with a huge crowd and like lots of diverse groups of people and stuff. And um, I don't know, I'm excited just to see what happens and see, I don't know, see where Fusion takes VMOD. What can we expect from you guys at Fusion? Uh, it's definitely something new for us. We're definitely taking uh, a challenge on this set. Uh, it's not a typical set, so we decided, what the hell, let's just go for it. We have nothing to lose. Uh, leave it all on the stage, and that's pretty much where we're going there. We're stressing out for this month, but it's all going to be worth it, and I know once we hear that crowd, it's all that stress will all be worth it, and we're just excited to share what we can with the community, and hopefully they'll uh, take what we have to offer and really run with it. All right, I guess it's the other. Yo. Oh, be my friend!